Hi lovely viewers, it's me again your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. They started, they started, oh God told us that he, HH is not going to be the president. God told us his friends started leaving him. At a point where a chairman, the chairman of the party in Nigeria, we call them chairman, Mr. Charles Kakoma, a trusted person in the party, divorced him and ran to the ruling party. Men of God, we are busy prophesying. Ah, it's not going to win. It's not going. I said, if you don't win this election, I drop my microphone. I don't preach again. Jesus. So now he has won the election. Those men of God that prophesy lie. They are saying he's not going to win the election. God has chosen Edgar Galungu. They are the same one now that are threatening him with prophecy. God is saying that flag will go down. You are an idiot. Flag will go down in your own home. Yeah. And, and the president is not really well. what do you want him to do? Is he a magician? PF government destroyed the economy completely. He need time to sit down and fix everything from grassroots. No, so we're here. And the politics are over here. So if I hear him again, well, God told me that the president is not going to finish his tenure. You will never live to finish saying it. You understand, Sia One? You know, Sia One. I don't, I don't talk when I tell you that something is going to happen. That is exactly what is going to happen. You men and women of God, when you prophesy and your prophecy does not come to pass, it means you are a fake prophet. That's what the Bible says. The Bible says, how, how are we going to know? He said, when what they spoke never come to pass. If what you spoke, you spoke that he's going to lose the election and he won the election, you are supposed to be ashamed of yourself and leave the man alone. Leave him. You are supposed to get if, if it was me, I prophesied that uh, this a church was going to win and he loses. I will stop prophesying. I will hide. Shame will catch me. But this one, see, shame, shame is not catching them. They are still talking. Every day, President HH this. Every day, President HH that. Every day, President HH this. You forgot what he has inherited. He has inherited a rotten government. If you love him, pray for him. If I hear, if you open your mouth again, whether there is one sick one in Lagos, I don't know if they call him Isaac or what, and others who are prophesying rubbish, who deceived Eligan, Edigalung, you are prophesying rubbish about the president. If I hear it again on this altar, I swear upon God Father, if you live seven days, then you know that I'm not seeing one. I'm telling you. So, let us give him peace. Let us give him chance. Let us give him opportunity. MMD ruled for 20 years. PF ruled for 10 years. This guy is not even one year in power and you are agitating. You are going to die before your time because nothing is going to happen. If, if something has to happen to him, where will I be? Elephant in the road, the dawn of power, and Alright, that's all right for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you, lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutatim Pondum. I love you, peace. I gotta go.